Are there any captains around this area? Nope. Just Tars. Tars. Not that he's actually a captain anymore. He's a fucking war chief. Eh. Okay, apparently he's decided that the best way to go is to run straight by Tars Bowmaster. Great way to get shot. If this fucking prick stops hitting him. Shoot him! Shoot him, Tars! Shoot him now! Or fucking don't. Tars is so disappointing sometimes. He's like capable of imploding everybody. But not when it really matters. Whoa! That is something that was kind of cool. Uh-oh. That is something that's not as cool. I'm burning Tars to death! Oh, Jesus. Okay, Tars? I'm gonna do you a favor, okay? I'm gonna command you to go somewhere else. And that's gonna let you escape. Oh boy. Here, you can kill Rook Dug Beastmaster. Cause he thinks he's cool, cause he's got an arrow and a bunch of skeleton stuff on him. But he's not. You're a war chief. Show him what's really going on around here. Okay. Uh oh. Well, you know, I'm fine. I'll just climb up this. Surrender. So now that we've kind of cleared out the entire area from what we can see, we probably should head over to Nernum. But I'm gonna give this area. Like, a minute to show me slaves running away. Who might be able to give me extra missions. So we're gonna go straight into the middle of the area, where a large majority of the slaves are. And maybe we can find them. Yep, look at that. Two groups. <laughs> Alright, that was not the right group I'm trying to save. That's fine. Who am I trying to save? <laughs> I just want to like run one direction and lose the other mission, you know? I guess you have to kill that guy. There we go. Oh, wait. That, that other blue guy is an orc. Herp. Okay, so now that we've freed those guys, they're not gonna be going anywhere. Nope, never mind, they just disappeared. Well, fuck you guys too! I'll save the super easy guy. There. Please, save my friends. They were going to sabotage an archer tower, but they'll surely be caught. You mean they weren't already caught? The outcasts have become more bold. They dared to sabotage an Uruk watchtower, reward their courage with salvation. Oh. You know, that kind of makes it sound like they get, they got captured. And... I mean, I guess, you know, that's to be predicted, but... I would like it if I actually had a mission with slaves where they're not just all tied up. I feel like that's getting redundant considering I had to do it... How many times? Let's see. 24 times. 24 times! And if every single mission is literally, basically... Oh, and by the way, there are three dudes tied up. I, I'm not gonna be happy about that. Freedom. Oh wait, we'll let him explain it. Thank you, Ranger. We poisoned the slaver's grog, but he knew we'd done it. Can you help my friends? Yeah, sure. Where are they? One's all at the top of the area. Emboldened by their victories, the outcasts have dared to poison the Urak Grog. Help them bring their swift death to their oppressors. Okay, and then we have the other one over here. Um, uh, We're gonna fast travel again, just to see if anything 
else pops up. This seems to be a good way to... Yep. Keep the fucking outcast missions plug in, because there's always one guy. Yeah, you with the sad, pathetic look in your eyes. You gonna cry, huh? I'll give you something to cry about soon enough. You're not gonna do much of anything, because you belong to me. And I don't like what you're doing. I'm sorry, you have to say this. You wanna fight back. They even stole some weapons. They took my friends. I'm in your debt. Okay, and where is that one? Way over here, Nexu Tower. Good. The outcasts were beaten down after stealing swords from the Uruks. Well, as soon as I'm done finding new missions to do... And I'll go over there. Okay, yeah. That would be now. That would be now. Okay, so here's our goals in life. We are going to... Not attack the grog. We're gonna go to save Bart, or not save, but we're gonna help Tar's Bowmaster. Kill a couple of dudes. And then we'll go save the outcasts. Okay. Uh, level 11. Ha! <laughs> right. I won't even have to do anything. Watch. He's just gonna die on his own. You dumb! How much longer until fight starts? Eat shrock and die, you shrock eating shrock! Wow. Language, friend! Shrock eating shrock? You fucking kidding me? Hold up. Let me get a higher vantage point of the area. If they fucking last long enough. Okay. Let's see what happens. Actually, Tars is getting his ass kicked. All right, coming on down to help. Sup? Would rather Tars survive than die. Pink skin. Come for a scrap, have you? You'll get one here, all right. But should I? I mean, maybe I shouldn't. Because what if I want to death threat him? We're gonna death threat him right now, right here. Target's too close? Damn! Fine, I'll death threat some other guy like this level 3. There, now you're not as pathetic. Hey! Yeah, you know what I could do? I'm gonna brand you. No? Okay! Then you die! They don't accept my loving combat branding touch, they die. I was actually thinking of branding him and making him uh Tars's bodyguard. That would have been really amusing. Uh, there you go. Alright. So, Tars. You uh come back to life often? Alright, oh, you do. Dick. All right, we're gonna use you as a death threat. We'll send you against this guy. Ooh, now that's a powerful dude. Well, now that he has a death threat. Are there any other, like, high-level guys? Without death threats? Not really. Okay. Well, let's go save ourselves some slaves. Because they've gotten themselves in shitty situations. Uh oh. Crosh. Crosh Skull Collector. Well, Mr. Crosh. I kinda wanna kill you. Maybe. One moment. You saw nothing. Come on. Just death threat the dude. 
wish I could just death threat all of them right now. Okay. We're gonna attack him? Uh-oh. This is, uh, awkward. I didn't realize they spotted me. Okay. Well, I might as well kill him. Hi, friend. No. I'm combat branding you so I can get my sh elf shots back. Okay. So, my plan is I'm going to really fuck with this dude. And then let him get away. You know? At last, you poke your head out of your crypt. But I'll put you back in for good. I, I doubt that. I come back pretty often. Watch what happens to you, friend. Oh, he slides his head up. Well... He wasn't going green. <laughs> so, whoops. Sixty-one percent chance to cover fifty health for each drain from above. That is pretty solid, actually. Isn't that the same thing? Sixty-one percent versus sixty-seven percent. No, it's not the same thing. Ooh. Well. I kind of want that. Where'd it go? Um... Harbinger of Doom. There we go. So now, if I'm really lucky, I can literally get, like, a hundred health. It's not a hundred percent health, but I could get a hundred health... ...from that, from just training people from above. And, if I combine that with the other ability... I could get even more health. I am basically never gonna die unless I'm fighting against level 20s. Level 20s can still screw me over if I'm not careful. And I learned this during the three hours that I'm, you know, <laughs> that, that got basically kind of corrupted. Because I got shot once and I lost almost all of my health from a level 20. And that was, uh, that was a learning experience. It takes a lot of fucking effort to get people to level 20. You pretty much have to just keep on running up to them and dying. And, you know, that's not awful, but it's also not a lot of fun. <laughs> you know? Like, there are aspects of the Nemesis system that are cool, but that's not one of them. And I'll come back! I'm trying to brutalize you from above. Ah, fine, whatever. Realizing him from the- Jesus Christ! From here! Okay. I don't have to be stealthy, I just have to get three brutalizes. Come along. Right around the corner. And you die. Right above the Karagor pit. So if he ever looks up, well, at least he'll have a nice meal. A nice nibble of a foot. Yeah, come on right around the corner. Don't suspect the human, he did nothing wrong. Ah, uh, there you go. Boom, now we're good. Hello! How are you guys doing this day? I don't want to deal with you, so we're gonna combat brand you. There we go. Now I have five slaves to rescue. This is obviously gonna take me quite a lot of effort, but we'll be fine. Dirty coward. You're a fucking Uruk. You'd probably do it to him. I'm just saying. Whoops, that was a worm. 
Could have gotten some valuable info from him. All right, here, have a wraith flash. And then, a wraith burn! <laughs> oh, yeah. I love it. It's such a handy thing. Sometimes it can be a little iffy because you might end up sending the enemies really far away with your blast, but it's fine. Well, obviously not. You tied them up. Maybe you should let them just fight you and die, and then capture them, and, and then you insult them for not fighting you. <laughs> Although, with that said, just because Wraith Flash is really awesome doesn't mean I'm going to use it all the time. Only when times get real desperate. Because generally it's just a lot more fun to execute everyone. Or make your heads explode, like this. All right, back to saving the slaves, which I kind of slacked off a little bit on. Hi. Over here, help me. Ranger, thank you. I wish they would give me more of a reward than just like basically money. Help me. Nobody sneaking around. Hey, hey, you don't see anybody here. Will you help? Well, especially now. Yeah, no, I don't know. I don't feel anything when I save these guys. Like, I acknowledge in my head that these guys are in a shitty situation and that, you know, they were slaves and they're getting tied up for really awful reasons. But beyond that, there's nothing else to them. I don't eventually gather up an army of outcasts. I don't have a visual feedback to see that, you know, hey, I'm doing a good job by saving these guys. It's actually kind of one of the more disappointing elements of the game. At least when I grab an artifact, you know, I can get the story. It's just empty words. I'm gonna rise up against the Uruks. No, you're not. You're just going to disappear forever, just like every other slave I slave. I- wait. Did I just say save slave? Every slave I save, not every save I slave. <laughs> oh, gosh. Oh, why is this one super far away from anything? Well, the good news is, I can just quick, quick travel to here. Real quick, see if anything else pops up. Ah, uh, no. Darn. Okay. There's usually a Karagor in this direction. In fact, look at that, there's a Karagor over here. Ah, uh, no. Come on, attack me, little Karagor. Okay, fine, don't. Yeah, I helped. Majorly. Kind of. Ow! Is it attacking me? You son of a bitch! If that's what you really think of me, Mr. Karagor, why don't you rush straight at me? No, over here. Come on! You know you want to! Hit me with your best shot! Yeah! Okay, there you go. I got the Karagor. And now I'm gonna drain him a couple times. Because he was a bad boy. What? You pathetic talk. Is this dumb beast the best you can do? Um, yes. Well, no. I mean, if you want me, I can, I can go get Grog. I don't know where Grog currently is, but if you follow me around, I'm sure I can find one eventually. Or I can just beat you down. Hi. 
No, 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 no. Come on! Bite him down, boy! That is a lot of fucking archers. Oh my god, they killed my guy! They killed my Karagor. And that makes me really sad. Oh, I missed! Are you serious? Well, you know what? I need health, so we're gonna drain you real quick. There. Oh no, I didn't mean to do that to this guy. Fine, whatever. Cancel it out. I really suggest you run. It would just help you out massively if you ran away from me. Or you can get killed by that, you know, little guy. Ow. Ow! You son of a bitch! He is really persistent! Ah, oh, of course he's immune to range. Oh, shit. Well, congratulations, you killed me. Or not! <laughs> what? He ran away. Must well, that was, um... That was different. <laughs> that is not what I anticipated at all. And they killed my fucking character. That took a lot of effort to get, you know? And they ruined it. Oh well. There's more. <laughs> there are more Karagors now. Hey, where are you going? Oh, that's right, you're getting in my hands so that way you can tell me all the information! Okay, so. How about this dude over here to the right? Hoshgrish the mountain. Ah, you know, I've dealt with a mountain before. Alright, you served your purpose. Thank you!